Alright, how's it going guys? So we are back with some more K2 and I have moved my copper here. I actually ran out where we were mining it so I had to move it over a bit and our research got done for the crusher so I started on the greenhouse and it's going well and almost done so we're going to get our first crusher made here so we can actually start making some glass because we're going to need the glass to make the greenhouse And I'm going to go ahead and pause while this gets done because it's dark and I don't have lights yet. All right, so our stone is down here, but I've got like 350 almost. So if we just throw this down for right now and we can just throw 200 stone in there. And then we just need to get some power to it, which honestly, I'm not even going to waste the time putting it down over here. I'm just going to throw it right here and then throw our stone in it and that'll make us sand. And if I make a new furnace. We should now be able to make glass, get an, uh, yeah, for this we'll just do it by hand. We're not going to need a ton of glass, just enough to make our greenhouse there. We'll have other uses for the sand later, I'm sure. Uh, we can actually look up here. So we make sand for glass. We can also use it with water to make landfill eventually. Uh, we can use it with water to make quartz eventually. Chlorine and hydrogen. So that's it. So greenhouse will be done in just a second. We have our first bits of glass here. So as soon as that pops, which you just did, we can go ahead and get our greenhouse made. Now, we're going to go ahead and do the regular automation now. Get that done. And then I think our next step is going to be, well, I'm going to go ahead and do the iron pickaxe just to get it done and out of the way. And then I'm going to do the red card so we can get that done. So we can get into regular electric inserters and electric miners and our logistic stuff. But let's go ahead and look at this greenhouse here. So we need 20 glass, 20 wood, iron beams and automation cores so let's get a bit more glass here so we can make our first greenhouse and that will help to supply the wood that we need in here for making our carts because we are out of wood So as soon as that gets done, we'll get that place down and start automating some wood. All right, so, so we don't have electric inserters. I'm going to tuck this right up in here and we want it to make wood. And our only recipe right now for that 
is this one, so we just need to provide it with water. So that means that we need to make a bunch of water pipes and get them up here. Luckily, we have lots of iron done to do so. Uh, do we have any water? Uh, yeah, we actually have water right here. Alright, so let's just do another one of these, another one of these. And then we can go ahead and just pipe the water down here from up there instead of having to go all the way from down there. So we'll just put this here. We'll hook a windmill and give it a electric pole. And then we can run this down and we need to go into here. These pipes go way further than in vanilla. Which is quite nice. Alright, there we go. That's our water. So now this is making us wood, which is seriously slow. But you wouldn't expect anything else. And hmm. Yeah, without any other inserts, I can't really. Um, I think it might run off the wood. Yeah, it should run off the wood for fuel. Let's see how much this is actually going to make. Um, it says 40 wood. So it's kind of slow, but it gives us a decent amount. So when that gets done, it should fuel itself. And then input all of that in here for making our circuits or our uh, tech cards. All right, and these assemblers are slow as hell. As soon as we get the other ones made, we can get started on some faster assemblers. These are damaged, so they're rather slow. Uh, if we look at tech cards here, this is our damaged one. So it takes 40. Which I guess is the same as a regular assembler, so I guess it doesn't really matter if we're using that one or the regular one. Huh. I thought these were actually slower than regular ones, but guess not. Alright, and we've got plenty of wood sitting there. So one of them will take care of that just fine. Somehow my alt thing got turned off here. Uh, which one of these data cards is not anywhere near fast enough to run both of the labs I have, but we'll deal with that later. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and get the... Iron pick research just so we can get that out of the way, pick up things faster, and then like I said, we're going to start on the automation tech card so we can get that done and we can actually get to proper inserters. Because right now we really just kind of got to weave our way through all of the things. 
since this is now done, I need to move it again. And I'm just thinking how I want to do this. Because I'd like to get rid of what's on this side first, but I can't put that there without the because of where the coal is. There is this little bit, but that's not going to give us very much. But yeah, screw it. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of it. That way when we actually get to proper miners, we don't have to deal with that. Alright. So that will get us more iron going. And now I just got to sit here and wait for more research to get done. So I will be back with you guys when we actually get the automation tech card done. And we can start looking at making it. So have a good one. And I'll see you in the next one.